Question 64. Consider the following instruction sequence for a hypothetical risk processor. <clears throat> Which of the following is a possible legal execution order for the instructions of an out-of-order out processor without register renaming? Um, register renaming means we can trick the processor into changing the names of these registers, so we're not going to include that. What you see is what you get. And then out-of-order processor means you can go ahead and execute this, this, the uh, steps uh, not in this sequence, but you have to still get the same result. So, which is a legal execution order? Well, the, I think the easiest way or an, a way of doing this problem is to take a look at these, at these steps and ask yourself, what would cause a problem? For example, here, if step V gets executed before step U, then this R5 is going to be wrong because here it's outputting an R5 and you would be using the wrong R5. So, so we have to check all the answers to make sure that, that V is not before U because if V is before U, there's a problem. Okay, same thing goes for if there's a W, if there's a W before T, then uh, the W is using R1 and T is outputting R1. So you can basically check the inputs and the outputs and make sure that there's no conflicts there. I just went through each one of these sentences and said, well, V could be a problem if the V came before the U. And and W could be a problem if the W came before either a T or a V. If it came before a V, you see that R5 is the problem, you see. So you can go through these uh, particular things, but basically for V, V cannot come before U. W, W cannot come before T or V. X X cannot come before T or W. Y, Y cannot come before T or X. And Z, Z cannot come before T, U, or W. Now, on the, on the, the interesting thing about W is, the reason why Z can't come before W is because both of them output to R9. And so, if Z comes before W, the uh, value in register 9 is not going to be right. So, simple, tr simple process going through the answers. All of the answers have one of these problems except answer A. So the answer, the correct answer is A, and the solution was T, U, X, V, W, Z, Y. That is an acceptable sequence.